This summer marks 20 years since our mother died and she achieved so much in her life. Our mother lives on in the countless acts of compassion and bravery that she inspires in others. So Harry and I are delighted to be with you all today to award the Diana Award. The reason I was nominated was they saw the work that I was doing with my mum, promoting mental health awareness. I work with charities for disabled children who've got similar disabilities to what I have. I decided to write this choral work that would bring together children from different religions to sing for peace in the Middle East. I run robot workshops for Tourette's and autism kids. I collected bags, books and other school supplies from my school and donated it to kids who cannot afford these items. I'm trying to promote equality within children, to do sports so disabled children and mainstream to work together. We decided that we wanted to showcase what Diana's legacy means. We wanted to showcase young people who embody those qualities of kindness, compassion and service to others. When I received the Diana Award, I kind of just went on my bed and jumped for like 30 minutes. <laughs> and then I kind of came back down and I still couldn't process it. I was ecstatic and I, it, I'm really still trying to process it. It took me about two to three days to realize what happened and yeah, it was so amazing. I see everyone is very excited, they're emotional, like they're nervous. The Diana Award shows us so clearly how young people have the immense capacity for leadership, innovation, inspiration, and service. So many of these other kids do so many awesome things, and they're so selfless about it. So that really inspires me to aim for it higher for what I do. This means everything to me, to show people what I can do personally and show them I can break barriers. It's just such an honor to be associated with a name like Princess Diana's. She's my role model. One of the things our mother taught William and I was the value of doing good when no one is watching. It is this spirit of quiet selflessness that unites these 20 recipients. They acted for the good of others, not for themselves. Our mother once said that if we all play our part in making our children feel valued, the result will be tremendous.